here we are with glide near episode 12 so yeah if you like what you see leave a like subscribe or comment let me know what you think and i would say let's get to the episode Oh really? Oh that's their friend. Okay, he has hundred coins. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, I would say so. He was on the picture. And Elena too. So what is he he's doing here? <clears throat> so they split off. Oh, maybe to get his power he had to sacrifice Hanaoka or whatever her name is. Hanako. Um, Maybe that's why she is like his power. So, maybe he needs a sacrifice or something? Hmm. Pretty interesting that he got the 100 coins. Maybe they did it together and he just took the coins and wanted to get his wish. Hmm. But maybe the power he has is not what he wished for. Maybe that's something else. Then the question is, what did he wish for? And couldn't he collect another 100 coins to get another wish, maybe? Why is he just standing there and protecting the place? That no one can get the coins, huh? Hmm, very interesting, I would say. Like, what is his reasoning for what he's doing? Or what he did? And I guess Elena and the others just want to stop this all, so that's why they want to get the 100 coins. But what did the guy mean with as long as he gets his cut? I guess from the 100 coins you can only get like one wish. I don't think you can like cut it off into multiple wishes, right? I don't know. So what cut is he talking about? Like money? I don't think they get money from this, right? Hmm. Very interesting. Oh. <clears throat> A few months earlier. Before they started this all. Who is he talking about? Also from, oh, they were all in the cram school. Okay. <clears throat> so I guess he was interested in Hanako or whatever her name was. Because as soon as she said, now to do your best, he's like, no, I'm, I'm doing it. I do my best. And I guess the other dude talked about Aiko. Mm hmm
Chuichi and Elena. Monoka. Hmm. Damn. Get out, demon again. Oh my god. Easier said than done. Wow. <clears throat> but this is before everything started with the coins, right? So she must have come back. See, she switched bodies or something, and that's why she's weird. Huh. I'm a bit confused. She goes to the hotel. Hides behind Chuichi. <laughs> what happened to the real Aiko? Because Hanako or Honoka was into Naoto? Oh. <clears throat> I 
But didn't she want to bring her friends along here to help find the coins? Guess she changed plans. So, so that may be why he searched for 100 coins to get her back. That's his power. I guess it is the real Aiko, just that Honoka is inside on takes control. Maybe he killed Aiko. Because we haven't seen her since. In the current time. <clears throat> Stay home, bitch. Yeah, he's not happy about it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> the old cram school. Oh. The alien told us. <laughs> I mean, she also seems not really happy here right now.
Holy shit, dude. Dude, first I watched The Main Gold episode 11 and now I watch this. Holy fuck. Couldn't she find a coin and get turned back? I mean, the alien said that. The alien said that. Chuichi could get turned back for a coin. I'm confused. Did he kill? Oh, she killed herself and then she transformed herself into Aiko. Ah, okay. Okay, now I get it. Dude, he hung her too. What the fuck? I guess he killed Honoka Aiko because he thought that she killed the real Aiko. Oh my god. I don't think so. Hmm. And that's why his <laughs> mm -hmm. that was looking disturbing. That's why his power looks like Honoko or Honoka.
The tie-in, Jesus. And there's a costume doll again, in the shelf. Is she seeing it? <laughs> okay it was episode let me know what you think but yeah very interesting episode now we don't get the full picture of the backstory but we have a better idea about the backstory right so the part where honoka said that she would bring her friends along so that they could search for the coins together never came true because i guess aiko Killed herself before that. Before that happened, and then <clears throat> uh, Honoka just took over for her, basically, um, because she was feeling like no one would miss her, and she thought that Aiko would was a better person. And yeah, I guess the Kaito killed. Honoka Aiko because he thought that she killed that Honoka killed Aiko um. <clears throat> and not only because of that but also because I guess because uh... oh wait no uh... or did he maybe thought that Aiko killed Honoka I think he knew that it was Honoka Aiko and he killed her because the Honoka said the Honoka Aiko said that Honoka doesn't exist anymore. <laughs> um and because he likes Honoka, he killed the Honoka Aiko, right? And then later he finds finds out that Aiko killed herself and Honoka just took over and is like, dude, I just killed Honoka. Or a re for a bad reason, basically. And what's interesting is the part that apparently a white girl appeared, right, and asked for who I am, and if you can't answer, then you get killed. Is he maybe on like, or maybe maybe not anymore, but maybe he was like on a mission where he is like doing that stuff so that people remember Honoka and if they can't remember Honoka then he just kills them to keep her basically alive in the minds of the people I guess maybe I don't know oh my god dude um so anything else here but yeah, I mean we still don't so apparently Kaito found 100 coins he used the 100 coins, but what did he wish for? What did he get from the 100 coins? And what is, is his objective now? He said they can all disappear. I guess he means basically everyone can just die. I, he doesn't care. But what is, his, his, what is his objective? That no one should get 100 coins anymore? But why? Maybe that no one can like reverse everything or make it, everything stop so that he can hang on to Honoka that he has as his power basically um, and we also still don't know what happened right why what happened in the past that Chuichi and Elena and everyone or that Elena did what she did to Chuichi that he can't remember and all that stuff right and we still haven't seen how it got to the point that he drank that stuff right I guess they got to the point because they were like, maybe, yeah, we have to stop this or something. We have to see what's going on, and for that, we need the powers. 
So yeah, we still don't really, there is still like missing information, right? From the past, what happened, that it turned out how it is now. And yeah, I mean, Naoto and Elena still are on the mission to end this game basically. Because of this game, everything basically started. Um, so yeah, lots of missing information still. Oh, I mean, not lots, but like there's quite a bit of missing information that we know what exactly happened, that everything turned out how it is. And yeah, now we basically have like, I mean, there's still like missing information when it comes to like, what is the plot of the anime, right? I mean, obviously it's like finding 100 coins and bringing everything to an end here, right? But I mean, we are not at a point where Chuichi knows about Kaito because his memories got erased. He doesn't know that he found 100 coins. We don't know. Um, we never encountered him basically, right? So in that regard, there's like still missing information. And we're at the end of the season because this was like the last... Uh, that was the last um, source material episode. The next episode, episode 13, is apparently only anime uh, anime original so it has nothing to do with the manga really it's like separate um so yeah and i mean <clears throat> the end of this is like basically very cryptic right because we can basically go by the end from last episode where it was again that chuichi said that he's not the main character and then we saw kaito and he's like I'm the main character and the end is already written so that's very cryptic and I guess nothing about that will change with the last episode because it's not canon so yeah still very mysterious and want to get more information about what is going on really because I feel like there's still some missing bits that I would like to know but that I only will find out if I start reading the manga which I most likely will, because I enjoyed this a lot. I liked this so far, the first 12 episodes, which are like canon. The last episode is not canon, so I guess in that regard it won't uh, change my mind about the manga, I guess. Because the manga is different at that point. Um, but yeah, I'm very much interested. I liked it. I loved it so far. And yeah. We will see how it goes with episode 13. But I guess that's pretty much all for this episode, right? Um, I would say so. But yeah, I'm also like confused about the beginning of the episode when the one guy said like, as long as he gets his cut. I mean, like I said, I what cut, right? Like money. But I, like I said, I guess they don't really make money from this except if they get like the coins and wish for money. But I mean, what they want the coins for is to end this whole game, so what is this cut supposed to be? Or can you get multiple wishes with 100 coins? So yeah, I, I wonder what his cut is. But yeah, that's like more stuff that we will get later, I guess. But not now, so yeah. But yeah, I guess that's basically it for the episode. So yeah, if you like what you saw, leave a like, subscribe, or comment, let me know what you think. And I would say thanks for watching, until next time. Bye-bye.